Hi, um, this is Vito here, and um, today I'll be doing a review over the uh, iOS 5 features on the uh, iPad 2, and um, so uh, let's get started. So, eh, as you can see, I got notifications, so. Yeah, I could just side up like that and. Eh, then. No. I'll just send myself a message. And see, there's a mail right up there. I think that's kind of cool because I get. Um. You can show you notifications. And uh, there's all my notifications. Okay, since you I got a bunch of. So, um, let's. This is notification center. So, and then. Then, um, I'll show you. Okay, first of all, okay, that's notification center, and then on the lock screen. Um, there is, we got several new features. Got, uh, reminders. Again. And we got. Do stand. Um. Let's see, I think that's about it for for the apps that built in. Oh yeah, Messenger, which is cool. And then um, let, let me just get out of that. And then um. So yeah. Um, see, I've got, okay, also, I'm going to get it to an application, which I don't know if I can do this very well. So there's photos, so you can take all five fingers. I guess I have to do it this way. Take all five fingers, you can swipe between applications, which is, I think is pretty cool. And then, um, And that will take you back to the home screen if you pinch with all five fingers. Which I think is pretty cool. And, um, what else? Oh, yeah, what to. I'm going to show you. Hold on. What it looks like. When you. What was a new message? Type. I'm just gonna text myself. Way number letters. And I'm gonna send it. See what happens. See, then there's me. And I just saw it, and it just take me directly to that. So then, um... Yeah, I just type. And so a bunch of gibberish. Send it. That's what it looks like, it just has a source. And if I type back, I don't know if it will. No, uh, it's not actually doing it right now. I'll be right back, let's see if I... Response to me. If it does, I don't know if it will, but well, usually when friend like people type, like right here, it'll be like in like a bubble, so you could see that they're typing. 
responding to you. And, um, so yeah, let's get out of that application. And a few more things they've added is to the camera, they've added, oh wait. Well, one thing they've added is Well, wait, back. Oh, they added, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a grid. See, like there's the little grid lines right there, I don't know if you can see, but. Maybe if I hold it like that, you know, you can't see it that way, so. Um. Well, right there, you can see the grid right there. And, um, so yeah, that's camera. I think I might have showed you on my other video what they added to the camera. Well, they added the edit button. And, uh, what option button you can add a grid or remove the grid and something else. I think that's for, like, the iPhone and iPod. And then, um... So yeah, and to the photos. Oh, there's my photos. Oh wait. They added. Ah oh, wait, go back. Uh, they added photo stream. It send when when you take a picture, have it on. It sends it all to to all your devices, so you don't have to worry about missing anything. So I think that's pretty cool. And we're just looking to see if I missed anything, which I didn't. So that's good. Then also a notification center. I changed some of it. Click notifications. You could switch it like. Manly by time, or manly, and switch change the order what you want it to do. There's those options right there, and blah, 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 and then you can turn it off or on. Or you can turn it off lock screen, for you and lock screen if you don't want to, then you can turn it off or on. Back, I'll we'll just close out of there. And, um... So, uh, yeah, that's about, that's, that's about it. So, uh, see you in my uh, next videos. Comment, rate, subscribe, and thank you for watching. Bye.